Hello learners, welcome to the NIYS studio. I am Dr. N. Johnson, working as assistant professor in the Department of Lifelong Learning School of Education, Aragappa University. Today, we are going to discuss about the topic, namely, initiatives towards community participation across the states. Now, let us discuss about what is meant by community. It is most vital to know about what community generally means. Community generally, it denotes a group of people who have common interest and work together. We all live in a community and some of the common factors that binds us to our community are language. We speak over the same language, therefore, they club together, they come in unison with each other. Territory, customs, following the same customs, tradition and culture, occupation and there are also some other common goals. Now, let us discuss about the significance of community participation. Community participation, when I say, it is most vital for the school, for the development of the school. If community participation is not there, the school will be not to, will not be in a position to progress well. The objective of community participation in education is to universalize education which means availability of schooling facilities to all children, getting all children to enroll and making the system responsive to retain all students. The goal of any kind of activity that attempts to involve community and parents, families in education is to improve the educational delivery so that more children learn better and are well prepared for the changing world. Participation of the community is a means to increase the mobilization of the financial human and material resources required to make the educational system as efficient. When we say mobilization of the financial, it is most important, financial aspects should come over, support of from the financial side by the community members should be there and human in turn. Sometimes uh, they come as a voluntary, they render the help to the school in a voluntary basis, either the youth members in the group or the women or the people, who, those who are in the community, they come forward in helping, rendering the helping hand to the school. And material resources, what does material resources mean? See, sometimes they give over tube lights for the school, fan, they donate fan to the school, they donate laptop to the schools, sometimes they also donate tab, all physical infrastructure facilities they donate to the school system and which is making the educational system as efficient also. Therefore, another significance of community participation is that the participation is also necessary to adopt education to the needs, problems, aspirations and interests of all the sections of the population, especially the weaker section. How a community can be involved? Community can be involved to the different ways. One is that participation in the survey for out of school children, enrollment drives. This shall be strengthened by the community members. 
Either it might be SMC or it might be the VEC, Village Education Committee or SMC. Therefore, they have to render the help in a voluntary basis. Sometimes they go out and find out easily who are the school children, dropout children who are away from the mainstream. They can bring over easily to the mainstream system. And as a result, when they bring over to the school, what happens? The enrollment of the students also gradually increases. Then comes involvement through the contribution of money, materials and labor. As I said before, all these three factors they can involve themselves. Then the third factor is monitoring the attendance of children. This is one of the important thing which has to be noted by the SMC members or VEC members. They monitor the attendance of the children, they have to send over whether the parents are sending the children to the school properly. If not, they have to find out what is the reason for them restraining from the school atmosphere and the regularity of the teachers. See the regularity of the teacher is also a very important aspect. Since in many schools which are in the rural background or which is away from the, which is far away from the urban setup, what happens? Sometimes the teacher do fail in attending or in going over to the school. Therefore, in such cases, the community people should act as a vibrant agency in regulating their attendance also. If not, they should inform and necessary actions will also be taken over in putting a regular teacher in the system of education that to in particularly in the school system. And monitoring the incentives like free textbooks, uniform reach to the students, monitoring the regularity and the quality of midday meal. See when these are all the textbooks, uniform, monitoring the regularity and quality of midday meal is that they deliberately come, sometimes many community members they deliberately come over, they themselves prepare the uh, midday meals for the students and they donate sometimes free textbooks, uniform. Therefore, these are all the ways in which the community members can be involved. Now, let us have a closer view of how the states are involving the community members. How this community participation is taking place effectively in different states. The first is the Andhra Pradesh, let us have a view of how they are doing, how the community participation is mainly carried out. Bal Mitra Kendra for girls have been started to cater to the needs of the girls. Parents play an important role in selection of the teachers, monitoring the centers and contribution to the teacher salaries. When this Bal Mitra Kendra, what is there now? They are strengthening the enrollment drive for girls, especially speaking. And it is also a non-formal mode, non-formal mode, they want to enroll the girls to the system. And this is quite interesting and effective, they are maintaining over and community participation is done in an effective way in Andhra Pradesh. Next comes Tamil Nadu. How in Tamil Nadu the community participation is carried out? The SMC, School Management Committee, in Kivapalayur, Kamaburam block, have donated rupees 2 lakhs 8905 for construction of toilet in school. See, the community members are coming, shouldering, deliberately coming out in helping a hand over to the development of the school. And that is visible over as I said before. Second, I shall say you many cases in which the community participation is visibly seen over and it is also empowering the children's, empowering the girls 
in different mode in getting the quality education. Second aspect is that the school management committee of GHSS, Government Higher Secondary School CN Palayam, have set up electrical incinerator in the girls for the disposal of napkin. Next comes contribution of smart class computers in GPS Sitkor Nagar. They donate over for the bringing over the smart classroom in the school premises and apart from that they also donate computers, laptops. Next comes contribution of bicycles by school management committee in Tiruvalluvar district. And another one is that purchase, this is one most interesting, I need you to draw you uh, confine your attention to this point. Purchase of AC fans, RO systems, three laptops by the school management committee in Vallambakadu, Pudukkote district. These are all the success stories how the community participation is done effectively under different zones in Tamil Nadu. And what happens, under, I would like to draw your attention to this point. What happens in Pudukote district, the enrollment of students was very poor. It runs some 12, 13 students were also, were only there studying. Later what happened, now in the present scenario, the enrollment of the students is visibly seen, it is strengthened, it is increased. And the community people see to see over they are purchasing AC fans, RO systems and laptops. See what a splendid contribution by the community members. Next I would like to draw your attention to another important thing is Kalvi Seed. This is a program which is visibly seen over in Tamil Nadu. What is this Kalvi Seed means actually? It is the gift to the school. Seed is the gift that is given to the school. While the students do come and join over in the school, either on the first day, what happens? They bring over some physical infrastructure, whatever it might be, like either it might be a fan or it might be a bucket or it might be a mat, whatever it might be. According to their own abilities, the community members, they bring over certain items physical items for the development of the school. Either it might be a tube light or it might be a fan, whatever, according to their own nature. It is not compulsion. They deliberately, voluntarily come out while the students take over this Kalvi Seer. This is a vibrant program which is running over or which is conducted in many schools they do over. Yeah, and in daily newspapers also you can see that while the schools are started, this Kalvi Seed program is running successfully in Tamil Nadu. Next, I would like to draw your attention to the Kerala state. Here to the Panjayat interventions in schools are also almost on the lines of infrastructure, maintenance and material supply. In addition to that, the SMC members as well as the VEC members, village education committee members, school management committee members, they do a good task. They come out with different innovative ideas and they contribute for the development of the school. In the Karakulam Panjayat, a strong emphasis on extracurricular activity in the form of Operation Olympia and the Kala Gramam programs is being conducted over in Kerala. Next, Assam. Here, substituting the teachers as per the necessity is shouldered by the community members. Motivating the parents of disabled children for their enrollments in schools is being done by them. In that area, if the students are disabled, they drive, they bring their children or the neighboring children to the school setup and mobilization of fund for the development of the school. Next interesting aspect is that 
Saturday club. What this Saturday club means? Here, the school management committee, mother groups, local authority and youth clubs, what they do over, they come in as a joint venture. They come over and they meet, in sat they meet on Saturdays and they teach different activities. Either it might be uh, stitching, viewing, drawing, painting, oratory, conducting oratory competitions, communication skill programs. Therefore, all the things are done over on Saturday with the support of all these members. And this Saturday club is also running effectively in the Assam state. Next comes Bihar. The sanctions and supervision of incentive allowance to students for regular attendance is carried out by the community members. Next, construction work based on cost effective technology. They do construct over toilets and they also construct other needed things which is essential for the school premises. Next, Panjait Raj institution members, they govern this midday meal scheme. They themselves come voluntary, they prepare, they serve, they monitor the midday meal scheme. Next comes Dadar and Nagar Aveli. Here, the provision of drinking water facility is shouldered by the community members. You know that they come out and installation of RO systems or providing of water facilities to the school students is shouldered by the community members. Next is a Shala Pravesh Utsav. That is, this is an enrollment drive to strengthen the enrollment of the students. The community members are helping and doing a good task over in Dadar and Nagar Valley. Next comes Gujarat. Yearly child care centers are being run and managed by the committees of Sakhi, Sayogni and Anganwadis. These communities monitor the centers and they mobilize the local resources. Next comes educational materials like asana patas, mats for sitting, books, notebooks, pen, pencils and snacks to the children in an alternative schooling system is also adopted by the community members. Next comes Ariana. In the Ariana state, the attendance of the children and the regularity of the teachers is monitored by the community members in an effective way. They do go over and check over and if at all, if there is any mishap or irregularity, they immediately bring over to the higher authorities. Incentives reach to the needy are also supervised by the community peoples. Next comes Imachal Pradesh. The quality and regular delivery of the midday meal is monitored by the community members. Support for participation in the national games. Here, what happens? The community members, they themselves procure various equipments for the development of for the strengthening of the children's in games activities so that their physical and also they gain a mental stability. And apart from that, the community members are also encouraging the students to participate in the national games. They do support over for the participation and that is a very successful drive which has been which the community members are doing over. Dropout of the students in elementary schools of Kulu district is nil. It has been found out authentically by the research study 
and the community members see how far they are effective in bringing the dropouts to the school systems. Next comes Jharkhand. Village Education Committee looks after the school management, teacher attendance, student attendance, construction work, girls enrollment, estimates of out of school children and the teacher appointments too. The parent teacher association meet on regular basis to monitor the progress and the problems of the children as well as teachers. The substitution by local teachers in the absence of regular teachers to facilitate the smooth running of the school. It is done only by the community members. If there is a long, attend a long leave by the teacher, immediately they do attend over and they um, put a temporary teacher in that position because the students should not be affected. That is the main criteria. Very good. Next comes constitution of child cabinet to promote interaction among the students. Then comes identification of the children with special needs for enrollment in schools. And thus the community members of the Jharkhand are doing and playing an active part over in the strengthening the school. Next comes Karnataka. Sanghas are running ball bodies with no financial assistance from Mahila, Samakya except the initial setting up and training to the volunteers. These Sanghas consisting of women are playing an active role in enrolling their children into the primary schools. Next come Mati Pradesh, Jan Siksha Adinayam Act 2002 brings the community to the center stage for ensuring the quality and equity in education. Updation of village education register, appointment of volunteers for non-residential bridge courses and human development center in urban slabs and Sishu Shiksha Kendra. Next come Manipur. The appointment of education volunteers in EGS and AIE centers and community mobilization program is carried out for the Mizoram state. Nagaland. Disbursement of salaries to teachers following the principle of no work, no pay. Orissa. Mobilization of parents for regular attendance in schools, initiatives for enrollment of girls, identification of out of school children under enrollment, temporary appointment of teachers in case of the shortage in the school. Rajasthan. Regular monitoring of the attendance of the children is done by the community. In Butera Gram Panjayat of Jaipur district, one of the toilets in the school was not built but was shown in the block's official records. The monitoring committee highlighted the issue and the correction was made. West Bengal, development of educational plans for children in pre-primary, primary, upper primary schools within their jurisdiction. Maintenance of the micro level database for the children in the age group of 6 to 14 years is carried out and the maintenance of accounts. Now let us quickly recapitulate what we have went through this video lecture. We have seen about what is a community and how well the community shall render the help to the school and what are the significance of community participation and how the community can be involved in the different ways. And we have seen quite different states, what are the role of the different states in community participation. In total, as a holistic one, I wish to say the community participation 
is a boon to the school. When the community participation is done effectively, the school will be growing and the school will nurture the fruits of success. Hope you enjoy this session. Thank you very much for a patient listening.